Now this is the Hamiltonian that was raised August the 9th, 1944, for a purchase of $33,577. And it was worn by Yankee Maid, again driven by Henry Thomas. And she was owned by A.L. Derby of Wichita, Kansas. Emily Scott, owned by Mr. C.W. Pellets and driven by Fred Egan, was 2-4. Enac was owned by Mr. Kane and driven by Harry Whitney, was 11-2. Paul Vineyard drove uh, Bruce Day, a colt by Guy Day, owned by Aaron F. Williams, was 5 3. And Seth Palin had Rapid Hanover, by Dean Hanover, owned by Mr. and Mrs. James B. Johnson, with Francis Van Lennon. Uh, was 3 7. Now you can see uh, Henry got right off on top and went on. And he won in straight heats in 2-5 and 2-4. There'll be another uh, race on here and it'll be a, a more detailed race on Shirley Hanover. It's another film that I got from Dick Thompson that shows some stuff about uh, Hanover Shoe Farm, but there is audio on that, which is nice. But you can see Henry there winning. And uh, it was nice that Mr. Derby was a wonderful person, a good owner from out in Wichita, and one of the backbones of the old circuit out there in the old days. You see right there, it was great to look up these books and find out their numbers, because that was number four Yankee made and Driven by uh, Henry, there's the second heat now. Now see these these were on movie film, but somehow or the other uh, film gets old and then lost the video. See, Seth made a break with Rapid Animal there. And this would be the second heat, and that's. Uh, that Enac was second. I think that's Enac right there with Harry Whitney with the elbow boots on. And that's Henry right there winning and going into the winner's circle. <laughs>